Alright, game three. We out in Ace Town, baby. Houston land of Vegas type of stuff. We about to damn run up in uh Houston. Grab games three and four. And drag our behind back to Oakland. And take our way to the World Series. But what is good, family? This is your boy Sledge, and we is back. Another episode of MLB The Show 22 featuring your own Oakland Athletics as we are in the ALCS Game 3 against the Houston Astros. Y'all thought we was going to go down 0-2, but this ain't the ALDS. We a whole different breed now. We coming out swinging and banging. And if you didn't see that last episode, I just you check it out because we put a whooping on the Houston Astros back in uh, Oakland. And damn sure they deserve it. And hopefully we can do the same thing in game three here. But make sure y'all run up these likes, man. Like and subscribe. Because I know y'all love the channel. I'll be seeing, sure seeing the love from the last channel. So show love for that. And show love for this channel too. Y'all see the damn two scores. Three to one. Houston, they got lucky. But you see five to one. Hopefully we get the same result. So for today's matchup, we got uh, Cole Irwin against Yaquiti. Uh, should be a good one, but I'm expecting a blowout. Don't mind me, but it is what it is. And on the mound for the Astros, you got Jose Aquiti. Damn, astonishing 21 and 5 record during the season. 2.17 ERA. 49 walks, 132 strikeouts. Let's do it! Nico Horner with a ground ball goes right under the pitcher's leg, rolls to the center field, and he is safe on first. That's how we start the games, ladies and gentlemen. Ben Gamble with a perfect shot that goes right to uh, right field. He is safe on first. Horner is on second. And Matt also gets caught looking if out no boom. boom. Austin Mills with a ground ball right to shortstop. Out at second, he gets a double play. Wow! Out at third, and they complete the double play. On the bound for the A's, Cole Irwin with a 1 0 record in the postseason. A 1.29 ERA out here doing damage. Let's keep this up, shall we? Kyle Tucker with a hit all the way to center field and goes right back to Tony Kemp and catches it foul number one. Michael Brantley goes right to Matt Olsen and brings it back to first base foul number two. Yo, the Alvarez goes right in the outfield and also Melo tracks it and catches it foul number three. End of one. Zero, zero. Carlos Correa swings and misses, and he's just laying in the infield, but still gets out at first. Foul number one. Seth Brown with a hit that rolls in the center of the left field, and it's safe on first. Matt Olson, I mean Matt Chapman with the ground ball, out at second, out at first with a double play. Out to Ve with a fly out all the way to outfield and Correa tracks and catches it foul number one. Burbank swings and misses foul number two. Trey Mancini with a shot right to Tony Kemp and catches it foul number three. End of two. Zero zero. Sean Murphy with a hit the center of the right field, but they catch it foul number one. Tony Kemp would have hit the right field as he tracks it. And that thing is out of here! Goodbye! Oh, hey, Tony Kemp puts the A's up early with that damn homer. Who can stop you? Nobody! Damn! Horner got caught looking for out number two. Ben Gamble with a ground ball. Goes right to third baseman. That was it the first foul number three. Jake Myers with a ground ball and Matt Chapman reaches it and throws it to Matt Olsen. Foul number one. 
Bob Minato with a ground ball right to Matt Chapman. Throws it to Matt Olsen. Foul number two. Bobby Witt Jr. goes right in the outfield, but Tony Kemp catches it. Foul number three. End of three. The A's are up 1-0. And Matt Olsen gets caught looking again. Foul number one. And Austin Meadows with a ground ball goes right past first baseman and Quiddy catches the ball gets him out in time foul number two And Carlos Correa gets caught looking for out number three Kyle Tucker was right the Austin Meadows in the left field as he went to the fly out and catches it foul number four Oh, Michael Brantley with a perfect shot that goes right past Matt Olsen and he is safe on first. Alvarez with a ground ball that goes rolls into the outfield and he is safe on first. Little man Altuve with a fly out all the way to the outfield and Tony Kemp catches it. Foul number two. Ah, Berman with a fly out goes right back to Tony Kemp as he waits for it and catches it foul number three. And a foul, you know what the score is. 108. Ooh, Seth Brown, but it goes right to second base. Actually, it goes to start stop foul number one. Matt Olsen with a fly out the right field, but they catch it foul number two. Sean Murphy with a nice hit that carries. Yeah, that thing is out of here! Have a nice day, you quitty! Home run off of two! Home run number two off your stupid ass! Let's go, Sean Murphy. We is running off the score today in Ace Town. That's what we do. Tony Kent with a ground ball right to first base and drags all the way to first foul number three. Trey Montini gets caught looking foul number two. Jake Myers gets caught swinging and missing foul number two. Ma Manado with a hit the left field as Austin Matthews waits for it and catches it foul number three. And a five, the A's are up to Duffin. Equal Horner swings and misses on the other side of the plate. Foul number one. Ben Gim with a ground ball all the way to second base and he throws him out. Foul number two. Back Olsen with a nice hit that travels to the outfield and he is safe on first. Austin Meadows looks like a fly out. That thing is carrying. Could it be a fly out? Could it be a homie? No, it's a fly out. And they catch it out number three. Bobby Wood Jr. with a ground ball to Matt Chapman. Throws it to Matt Olsen. Foul number one. Kyle Tucker with a hit all the way to center field. Right to Tony Kemp and catches it. Foul number two. Michael Bradley with a ground ball to Matt. Chapman throws it to Irwin and gets him out. Foul number three. What a play. End of six. A's are up to nothing. And on the mound for the Astros. Brian Stinnick with a 2.25 ERA. And that's all we have for now, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, Lord. Costco Reds swings and misses. Foul number four. Seth Brown swings and misses foul number two. Back Chapman with a hit all the way to the center field. And who's gonna get it? Nobody as it goes off the wall. And it's a home Goodbye. Third home burn of the game as Matt Chapman. Launches it off the wall and lights up the scoreboard. Somebody's in trouble. Sean Murphy would hit the right field. And yep, first minute she catches on the pop up out number three. 
Yo, ha, Alvo Reyes with a hit that goes right to Tony Kemp and is safe on first. Al Tuve with a hit that says fair into left field and he is safe on first. Alvarez is on second. Oh, man, swings and misses foul number one. Trey, oh. Trey Monsini gets him out foul number two. I can't even get the words out my mouth. I don't know why. Jake Myers swings and misses out number three. End of seven. Aza up three, nothing. And on the mound for the Ash Row. Had the Neris. And he has absolutely nothing, which is kind of good. So let's do our best to hit this guy. Tony can't win a nice hit the right field, but they catch the line drive out number four. Nico Horner would hit the center field as he awaits and catches it for out number two. Matt Olsen with a ground ball that stays nowhere but to the catcher and throws him out at first for out number three. And coming to the bound for the eighth, the Eagle Castillo with a 1.29 ERA. I told you we were going to get that thing down. Nine strikeouts, no walks. Bob and Nalo with ground ball right through Horner who throws it to Matt Olsen. Foul number one. Bobby Witt Jr. gets caught looking. Foul number two. Kyle Tucker swings and misses. Foul number three. End of eight. These are up three. Nothing. And on the mound for the Astros. Rafi Montero also has nothing. Austin Meadows with a nice hit to left field and nobody is over there as it just goes right off the ball and Austin Meadows easily gets a double. Carlos Correa it goes to center to right field and it's still traveling right off the wall and Carlos Correa is what the hell I guess he decides to go back to first. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to take him out at first. Hey, I'll take it. <laughs> Seth Brown with a perfect shot. And that thing is carrying the left field. Hey, oh, boo. He gets him out. Out number one. Matt Chad with a ground ball. It was right to sort stop. Out at second and out at first with a double play. Michael Bradley with a ground ball right on Horner who jumps, hops, throws it to Olsen out number one. Alvarez with a ground ball to Chapman throws it to Olsen out number two. Little man out to the swings and misses out number three. And that is the ball game, folks. The Oakland A steal one in the Houston take game four. Four. To nothing. Shut out fashion. I think Cole Irwin gets the win in his first shutout game this season. Actually, in this series. It's actually my first shutout game this series. I'll take it. I ain't complaining at all. This is what we do. But hope y'all enjoyed this episode. Make sure I like and subscribe. Let's try to get five likes on this video. We up to one in the series try to go 3-1 before we head back to Oakland and shut these cheese strolls out for good but until then y'all stay blessed be back soon with a new episode have a good night have a good morning uh be safe drink and drive and goodbye